how's it going? Um, so today is Friday. We are in Galway. Um, it's a bit early. It's it's very early for me. I mean, it's before eleven o'clock, and we have to be up. But anyways, so we are at the uh, DSAI conference, and it's all about gender and equity and a little bit about HIV because hey, you know. It's there. Let's put it in there, you know. Um, so I'm going to be vlogging today and um, hopefully you'll get to see some interesting stuff. Um, and I'll put up some videos if I interview anyone. Yeah. Hi guys. Hi. How are you? So this is Douglas Hamilton. This is the cool dude of development. So he's going to tell us what the weekend's about. Well, basically it's all about getting together and, and uh, asking questions and answering questions about health, HIV, inequality, and the world we live in. Perfect. The financial situation that we're in, but not the misery, eh? We're not long paralyzed streaks of misery, as some people might think. We're actually here to act, and we're here to do good things, and we will do that. Look, Perfect. that's what I think. Thanks so much, Doug. Bye. This is Bianca, who you've seen before, Hi. and Nelson. Hey, Nelson! Hello. The Black Superman. So, uh, <laughs> Nelson had a poster up today, which he's now taken down, and uh, Bianca's just been wandering around volunteering. Hey, what, you want me what? to lie? Okay. Like, am I supposed to so, lie or So, Nelson. Yeah? How did you find the conference? Um, like, it's been great, you know, like, um, really fantastic, and, um, um, what do I say, like, um, you know, I've learned a lot from this conference, like, um, you know, from the guys who have been to the field and all that. It was more like a practical session for me. <laughs> what more can I say? Um, so, there was a talk earlier by a man named Talks. Dr. David McCoy, and he is with um, MEDAC, a super interesting organization. Again, networking, he talked about a lot of development issues and a cry to the new next generation of global health professionals. Yes, that's us. And what are we going to do about this? My name is Aoife, like you say, I'm a fourth year medical student here in NUIG, so I decided to come along. The one thing that stuck in my head actually from a medical student point of view was uh, when the concerned speaker was speaking about um, the community care workers, how they um, hand out the leaflets and st if they're illiterate they give mm -hmm. them the pictures instead, which is mm -hmm. an absolutely brilliant idea, uh, gives them the warning signs of extremely sick children compared to someone with just a fever. So it just really reinforces the importance of properly training uh, community care workers. I woke up this morning on the wrong side. So hey guys, so this is Anya and Charity and these guys are students down here in Galway and um, they're studying gender equality. Gender globalization and rights. Oh. They're covering it all. So they're just going <laughs> to give us their thoughts on um, the conference this weekend. Um, uh, well, I'm a big fan of conferences in general, but uh, this one particularly I find very inspiring. Um, I found one of the talks by um, David McCoy today, actually. Just mm -hmm. I just came away really feeling inspired by it. Um, we kind of covered everything, really. Um, climate change hasn't really been my area, but um, I think talks like that really just... just bring the bigger picture in and it's, yeah. Everything, yeah. it's all so important so I feel very inspired. That's great. And yeah, how about I, you? I was very inspired by the PhD student in the last session in development and mm -hmm. how she was able to make research personal and just the way that she was able to show us what we can do with our research yeah. and not to, not to lose hope. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's overwhelming sometimes so it was very inspiring. Awesome. The hazy sunrise wraps a veil so guys this is Carlos Bruin. And he is a longtime PhD student and uh, changing the world of academia with his results. <laughs> so I was just going to tell us what he found interesting about the conference this weekend. Um, one of the things I was looking at coming down here was there is health, there is gender, there is development. 
country, very broad, different areas. And really, I think in this afternoon, in a couple of sessions from the bigger plenary sessions to one of the smaller ones, it wasn't just that those three areas started to integrate, but also that things that are happening in Ireland also started to be brought up. Yes. Around direct provision for uh, people who are seeking asylum here and how that directly relates to policies in Ireland, in Europe, and then more globally. So it was yeah. good to see that blending and connection starting to come together. Yeah, it's awesome. I can't get motivated, the swimming thoughts are drowning I just think it was really great, the big diversity of you know speakers and topics presented, uh, everything from trade unions to climate change, community level health, um, all with a big focus on equality and gender. By some coincidence, I do just what they say. Hey guys, so we have finished up our conference. Oh, sorry, sorry, Bianca, out of shot. We've finished up our conference at the Galway Christmas fair, festival, market, market. Um, we got pork, <laughs> delicious. Very good. Uh, the atmosphere is awesome. I'll just give you a quick shot. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Ready? <laughs> yeah, awesome. Stuffed, ready to get on the train and go to sleep for the next two hours. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is the end of the day guys. We are back on the train going back to Dublin. It's been a hell of a day. Lots of information. Um, a little bit too much food if I'm honest. Could have done without the pork at the end of the day, but it was awesome. Um, so hopefully we'll see you guys next week and I'll give you a bit of an insight into what life is like when you're writing like four papers at the same time. Awesome. Bye. Who is warning you? The Sabbath branch is storming through in the dawn of the morning.